today I'm going to prepare keema peas curry. So for that we need uh, keema, one cup, peas, three by four cup, tomato, dhania powder, chili powder, uh, ginger garlic paste, uh, garam masala, on cut onions, and a dry coconut. For masala, we need to grind all the ingredients in the plate except tomato. So we'll do it now. To the mixy jar, I've added uh, dhania powder and chili powder. Now I'm going to add ginger garlic paste, garam masala, uh, chakka, lavanga, and alaki and um, dry coconut cut onions okay so we'll make a paste see uh, for this curry i've taken one onion so for half onion i have taken for the gravy for the masala so half i'll be uh, like uh, making the roast uh, see uh, i have made the paste so we'll go to the next procedure uh, I have taken a pan and I have added oil for it. So after the oil get heated, uh, we have to go in, We are going to add onions. The oil is heated now, so we are going to add onions. Chop well till it uh, turns to brownish color. Uh, the onions are roasted now. We'll be adding cut uh, tomato to this. Uh, we'll, uh, we'll be adding salt and turmeric powder and chopped well. The tomatoes are soft now, so for this mixture we are going to add um, kaima and peas. So we are adding the peas and the kaima after adding this we have to sort it uh, till the raw smell goes. Okay. this uh, we need to add like we will be adding now the muscle which has grinded so now again uh, we have to sort it well, until the masala smell this is the smell of masala so we, till it goes we have to sort it well don't don't add any water at this stage let it uh, cook okay so until the masalas uh, like the oil oozes out if you put oil if you put water now it would look gravy uh, it doesn't look uh, tasty that is not look uh, the, the gravy doesn't uh, taste good and, okay so let it let this masala cook well uh, see the oil is slowly coming out okay so let uh, like cook for some more uh, minutes At this stage, uh, we'll add water. One glass of water is enough because uh, the keema doesn't 
uh, need much water to cook. Okay, so the water is only uh, to cook uh, peas and kheema. Okay, so the the now uh, we have to cook this uh, uh, gravy until it becomes thick. Okay, so let it cook. Uh, the gravy is ready now. Uh, the orange color is uh, slowly turning into brownish. Uh, so now uh, the gravy is uh, totally cooked. Uh, we can serve. Uh, we can serve now. So we'll be creating it to the bowl. Okay, uh, and uh, this can be uh, taken as side dish for uh, chapati, or we can add it with rice, or we can eat with puri. Okay. Thank you so much.